easy to pull off, but I'm willing to do it anyways. Alright, knife games. Knife games! And since I have no cards left in my hand, I can't do it. I'll shuffle everything and go from there. That also ends my turn. Alright. Alright, let's go in this. Hold on, this goes in the midline. Yeah. He's fine. That's true, nothing pushes. Yeah. Good. I love it when nothing pushes. Alright, cyber. Yes. <laughs> Alright, so. Alright, let him do some. Alright, this uh, turn I got my Ready for Anything Mercenary card, which means I can spend my stars as stars, which is good because I have one, two, three stars. And I have one star, and I have the She's Here as a Consultant, which means I could either play it this turn to get two stars, or I could hold on to it. I almost want to hold on to it. You know, just let this be a turn where I just kind of bring out. Plus, any card that is not in my deck is making my circulation fast. And those that have played uh, Ascension and Dominion know the importance of having a very smooth, fast deck. So, uh, I'm going to spend my three scars to scan a place. You can't scan Med Lab because it's low visibility. I could scan the airlock, but it's going to happen anyway. I can't really do anything to it. I might scan the weapons locker. It's either that or the power station. What do you guys think? What, well, here's the thing. Whatever, is, uh, whatever I scan the weapons locker, it's going to be much harder to scan once it goes into the Med Lab. So, I'm going to scan this. Fair. That makes sense. And we find another event card. Shit. So this now we have two locations. Shit's that hit are the fans, bits. son. Nothing's, one of Nothing's coming out, it's but just it's... dropping smoke. It's fine. Alright, so the fit has hit the shan. Alright, I'm gonna keep my consultant card in play. And my turn. Events. Alright, so the good news, bad news. I also have a vigilant that is meant for two stars at a later time. But it won't do me any good to scan that. It essentially does nothing, but I can't also fight it. It's true. I will hold on to her. I will have one, two, three, four. Four to spin. See, this was where I think having everybody in a green screen room would really pay off. Oh yeah, because especially if you can have those backdrops of like aliens about to bite your head off. Well, I could, I could. We could totally have a button where somebody just pops up behind. <laughs> um, but additionally, what it would allow me to do is make the board bigger. And then, because see all the back of the wasted area we've got because we're highlighting ourselves? If I can make the board bigger, then I'd be able to put more there, so. Have the entire board and then our heads just go. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to buy Stan Frosty. So she's going to be two stars, and I can also, uh, if I had played range cards, I could choose any number of players to each draw a card. Getting draws good. I'm going to place that with another place of power spell. Nice. Alright, so your turn's over. Alright, so everything's gonna push. What dirty thing just popped up in front of us? We'll find out in a second. So, entering the combat zone is. Ooh. a camouflaged xenomorph. Upon reveal. This alien cannot be fought this turn. So whoever's turn it is, you guys sit there while the thing what uh, surprises you. Can right. I shoot shit in the walls? No. So if I reveal it in the walls, I still can't shoot at like, it. Like, because it revealed on your turn. If I sh if I reveal something in the walls, and the and the truck coming to us, can I shoot it in the walls? No, because the rule is upon reveal, it can't be attacked that turn. Not this. Not He's that. Out, oh, if I reveal that, yeah. Right. If you reveal it and you can shoot it, yeah, you can. That's the whole point. Trying to ask because I'm like, well, that just <laughs> fucked me over. Well, yeah, it's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt. But that's why it's camouflaged. All yeah. right, so it makes much sense if you can see it coming. The room <laughs> right before us can still be scanned for two. Is that correct? Yes, that's correct. Very well. I scan for two. All right. Please. Scanning please. the airlock, we find. A Xenomorph Swarmer. Okay. Upon reveal, add a Hive card to the complex. <laughs> which just pushes one, him yeah. into the yeah. combat zone. 
So yeah, you're gonna get swiped at twice. No, I'm not. Oh. Knife games. Are you gonna you gonna try and take you gonna take that no one out? I have no idea what's gonna happen. But we're gonna do knife games. You have okay, to take them out. All right. So because I can't you, take out. Here's the question: Have you played a, t a card? No, with I that have symbol? not. All right. So it says draw versus draw strike. strike. So and you don't have a red card anymore. No. Okay. Yeah. Trust me. I totally agree. All right. So this is the this is what happens to Senor Rob. He gets double slashed, and so he takes one damage, and he has to draw another strike. Motherfucker! I didn't realize strike was always bad. Oh, well, no, it's not always bad. Oh. You get splash damage, the next player also draws a strike. Motherfucker! Hey, that's me. Don't don't laugh at me. We're all getting all right, raped. so I... Oh, I just get a flash wound, and it's just one damage. Really? Hey, that is one le just one less than what you just took. And I'm going to take all that. Well, no. No, well, no. no that's, you, now you have four, they were now you have four scars. Yeah, because they were alive at the end of the turn, that's when you take the damage. You're yeah, right. it's still your turn right now. Yeah, but I can't do it. I, that yeah, one guy dies. The yeah. other guy's not. Yeah, he's going to hit you. And it's going to hurt. Yeah. <laughs> this hurts a lot. <laughs> a lot. Okay, but right. this is in or out. Uh, that, that, you, you put that next to your character card, your avatar card. Oh, because I'm permanently hurt. Well, that's not different. permanent, because those the damage on those cards are white, white, which means it can be healed. Um, I'm not sure if this laptop is set to archive them. My main machine is, but the good news is my account is set to always do it. Um, but further to your line, uh, Big Head Zach is actually going to start doing that himself, where we're going to do a full, like, three-hour play, and we're going to chop it up a bit, and we're going to specifically break down the rules, how the game plays, and then give you the option to move right into the gameplay if you're already familiar with it. So yeah, we've already had that idea, but I appreciate you bringing it up. That is that is a plan for the future. It's not definitive yet, but it was on my list of things I want to do. Uh, I can force that to happen. Okay. <laughs> I mean, but like just basically, okay, you can't do it tonight. Fine, we're gonna do it here. All right. But I'd prefer to have you involved. No, I, I mean, as I was saying, I would your... like to do it. Yes, yeah. gotta go to deal with it. All right. Yeah. So uh, you fought that guy. Do you have anything else you want to do in your turn? Uh, I have three purchase power left. Um, uh, we have body armor. Hey, that would have come in handy. Boy, wouldn't that have been nice. Uh, uh, you have you want some of this, which is basically a cheap damage card as long as you... No, body got... armor sounds wonderful. What is it a permanent sit out? It's a vigilant, which means it stays out until, until you really use it. it. Basically lets you avoid a strike. Uh, done. All right, and then I'll pitch all this in the pile. All right. Now, just before we go on. Now, so, if, if a creature shows up in the combat zone, you will take it right at the end of your turn, you will draw a strike for every creature in the combat zone that does not specifically say, I don't attack. Okay. So we, because there are, there are certain guards that don't. They right. just they so, have other effects. So we just did the strike rule. Yeah, Addy, I've totally on doing well, that. Well, no, uh, they have, we haven't drawn strikes for him yet. The, stri the strikes we yeah. drew for him were the knife games. Yeah. Basically, yeah. Oh, okay. I gambled, <laughs> I got fucked, yeah. and now I'm about to get screwed again. <laughs> What up, dog? <laughs> All right, so this is the strike because the camouflage xenomorph attack has attack. Yeah, got... that, that's exactly what we're talking about. Adam. And you have a damaged hand. At the start of your next turn, discard this and two random cards in your hand. So basically, you start next turn with a crippled hand. Get it? So, no, but it's only a temporary thing. You're fine. You're fine, you're fine but you're... your next turn... No, 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 Rob. You're fine. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, that's right. You're a medic. Yeah. Medic! So he's saying, yeah, the idea is, uh, the idea is great. Come over to my place and record intros for popular games, including rules. Yeah, and that's that's part of what we're considering doing. All right. So my turn's up. Uh, the hive continues to churn. Churn like butter. Cards are moving. And what is our reveal? Entering the combat zone is. A hazard. This does not sound happy. No, it's not. And it's related to the location that we are in. Hazard one? Yes. What are we supposed to use? Harsh language? Each other player discards all characters in their hand that have a printed scars of one or more. Printed of one or more. That doesn't no, have it. No. That doesn't have printed of one or more. So I lose my grunt. I lose, lose my your grunt. grunts. Yes. They they just get discarded. They don't. 
They just eat it and it's there. That's that related oh. to that scene where he realizes they're fighting underneath the coolant, uh, to the coolant tanks, and basically no one's allowed to use their guns. Wonderful. Except Vasquez and Drake, they kind of chew. They do that anyway. So I think that was wise. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so my turn. Um, I fortunately have my close encounter shotgun. Thank you, Corporal Hicks. Which means anything I fight in the, uh, the first thing I fight in the combat zone this turn has a negative two defense. Mm -hmm. So I have three combat to spend. I'm going to type. Well, that thing is now one to kill. Yeah. So I'm going to kill it with one. So it's dead. I can now scan something. Like I can scan the airlock and maybe I get lucky. I think you guys are both right. We'll absolutely do that. And it, I'm glad to see other people in the channel are agreeing with this as well. And it's not just us, so... Well, in the future, that will happen. That may have bitten me in the butt, but it's probably better that I took it rather than uh, Steven. Uh, it's a Xenomorph Swarmer, which, upon reveal, adds a high, uh, high card to the complex. So, this pushes... The good news is, this uh, this entire thing is being reported. Nice. So Our deaths will be reported <laughs> for posterity. No kidding aside, this game is the most fun I've ever had dying a horrible death. It's so, so thematic. It's... I'll give you that it's definitely thematic. <laughs> you, 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 <laughs> you literally stabbed yourself in the hand. I know. I was like, well, that works. <laughs> Alright, next time. Hey, fellas, next time, watch this. Next time, that game is been wrong, not the other way around. Alright, I have four stars <laughs> left to spend. Uh, I would love to grab another one of these uh, close encounter cards because they are paying off for me. And what's that one do for you? Uh, it's a two gives me two scars, but it also makes uh, uh, enemies in the combat sorry go to kill. Oh, nice! So if I'm just willing to get my, if I'm willing to just get be in the threat zone, I can take things out. Run the soldier up a little bit. Uh, new card. And I have my vigilant plus two stars too. I gotta remember that. New card's another body armor. Now, I saw you put, okay, but nothing's rolled into the other one. Now, I'm about to take a strike. This is the end of my turn. <laughs> yeah. Hold my beer. <laughs> hey, watch this. Nothing good has ever ended after the turn. Hey, fellas, watch this. Hold my beer. <laughs> All right, time for strike. The, what the you Stormer. Get teddy bear. I get a deep gash for two. Okay, I get it. So, I have taken a total of three points of damage. Uh, I have eight hit points remaining. Oh, yeah. shit. Yeah, when you run out of hit points, you are gone. Like, put your cards away, walk, walk, go home, sleep it off. <laughs> I okay, just realized the drawback turn. here. These cards advance. Here's what I was left. I just realized the drawback here. Oh, no! No, you might actually get rid of it. Okay, we'll, okay. we'll see what happens. All right, combat zone. It's another swarmer. <laughs> the, the damn swarmers! But they're good. They're easy to kill. They are, yeah, but, but they, shit. But you have to kill them, and then whatever the next thing they push out. Because they're never just one swarmer. All right, it's another good. another one coming out. This is not going to end well. Oh, we found a colonist host. The this enemy does not move or strike. Uh, when an event happens, kill this enemy and put the top card of the pie face down in its place. So, you just need to kill it before another event triggers. Because if an event triggers, it's replaced with a top card of the high. So it's like a surprise, it's right here and right now. But we kill three of them, we advance the objective. I really do like the theme on this so far. Mm -hmm. I really do. Oh, and you will lose your mind when I tell you what is coming out in Gen Con. Predator. Really? With a PvP mode to see who can score the most honor. Oh, fuck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> and it is completely compatible with the Legendary Encountered Aliens and all Legendary Marvel products. Nice. Mega crossover. Get a little sound bite thing. A little button. Exactly! <laughs> a little Just, be like, whatever, somebody's not paying you. <laughs> That'd be great. Okay, That'd so it's my turn. Be... Yo. It's not going to be a lot, but. Another one of those. Alright, so what happens if I'm starting?